Have you ever heard this noise before? If you haven't, don't beat yourself up. This only happens every 13 years. That noise is made by the mad giant cicada. Aw, think you got away. This particular cicada comes out only in 13 year intervals. That means the last time these things were out was in 2001. And the next time they'll be coming out is 2027. Some cicadas come out every year, every two years, every five years, 13 and even 17 years. But why do these cicadas stay underground for 13 years? I'm M1 Henson, the bug man, and we are gonna find out. The bug man, the bug man, he'll catch a bug and show it to you, he's the bug man. He knows his facts, he knows all about the bugs in the sky and the air and the ground. The bug man, he's the bug man, the bug man. Scientists are unsure, but they believe that these cicadas must come in 13 and 17 year cycles to make sure that predators aren't used to hunting them. This means that multiple generations of predators will go by without even being exposed to the Magi Cicada. Let me explain it this way. <sighs> See, my brother M2 hunted these Magi Cicadas. He got good at catching them. He made cookies and pies and soups out of them. Cookies. Say he had a family, children, and then he died. Hey. Okay, let's fast forward to 2027. M2's offspring have never seen the Magi Cicada before. Therefore, M2's children will not know that these cicadas taste good in cookies and soups. So the cicadas will have more of a chance of surviving because the predators, M2's children, will not be expecting their arrival. It's true, isn't it? After a close encounter with that cicada, I decided to try again to catch one. So I found someone who wasn't afraid to get his hands dirty. My crazy little brother, Gillum. Where are you? Come to me! I want to find a bug! Ah! Ah! Come here! Come here! Please! Come here! Come here, where's your bucket? This didn't work, so I had to settle for my other brother with a net. There one is. Ah, ah, ah. It's a good thing you hired a professional. Well, at least you decided to put on your underwear this morning. Hey. So this is the Magi Cicada. Well, that's nice. Now you may be wondering how cicadas make their noise. The sounds you hear are only made by the male cicadas to attract a mate. The cicada flexes his timbers. These are a drum-like organ located in the abdomen of the insect. The cicada's abdomen is mostly hollow. This amplifies the sound made by the timbers. After mating, the female cicada cuts a slit in the branch of a tree and lays her eggs in the slit and deposits a groove over the eggs. This protects the eggs and exposes the tree fluids for the young cicadas to eat. After hatching, the infant cicadas fall to the ground and burrow in. Here they eat roots until it is time to come out again. This right here is a recent exit hole. When the time comes, they burrow out of the ground and climb a tree. Here they shed their nymph exoskeletons. They usually do this at night. That hard exoskeleton is what we find littering the trees and the ground. Are we rolling? Yeah. You were the only one who would know that. Oh yeah, I forgot. What? Now we're out here with the bug. Dude, why are you shaking? I'm sorry. I'm trying to... I, I, I don't know. I'm not a steady hand. Anyways, we're out here looking for those cicadas. We're going to find them and show them to you guys. 
little kid one is. He's crawling up a tree. Oh, yeah, I remember that. Yeah. That old bug. Oh, look, here another. Oh, yeah. These are beautiful insects. I love them. In the dirt. Mm. Oh, look at that one. Around. Good shot. Look, he, like, he actually thinks he's going to be able to climb up that weed. Poor thing. Maybe we should help him or something. Nah, watch this, watch this. Look at him. Ha! See, he fell. Oh, look, yeah. He ruined everything. He was probably going to make it. You probably scared him. No. Ooh, look, a hole. That's a good one. Hmm. Oh, there he is coming out of his shell. Oh, yeah. And look, his wings. They're pumping up right now. Hmm. They're pretty wings. Yeah. It looks like a grub with no, it wings. It looks like a cicada. Wait, look, look at that. And one that's a toad turd. But look, it, it toad ate this cicada and turned it into that. You want to show everybody a toad turd? You're not supposed to say that on television. Okay, here it is. That's just a toad turd. Blah, blah, yeah, blah. He's got bug guts in it and stuff. Stool. That's what it is. Toad oh, stool. toad stool. Yes. Oh, toad being all scientific, stool. aren't we? Yes. Mm. Yes. Now the newly molted adults' bodies begin to harden. This may take several days. Oh, and one, go over some common misconceptions. We don't need to do that. Oh, Fine. Gosh. Here, will this cicada bite me if I touch it? No, they won't. They don't even have mouths. What? See this? It's like a straw. It inserts this into roots and sucks the fluids out. So, do these cicadas also go by the name locust sometimes? No. What? They're cicadas. What's Lo a locust? Locusts are really just a form of grasshopper. Oh. Well, I'm done. <sighs> Good. Cicadas come in very large numbers because almost everything eats them. Oh, so ants really do that to them? Yeah, they eat them if they fall to the ground. Whoa. Okay. Uh. Yeah. yeah. I can see that. Dogs? Yep. Dogs, definitely. And cats. And even bigger ants? Yeah, bigger ants that live in trees. That's better. Toads? Oh, yeah, that toad turd. I forgot yep, about that. Toad, yes. Definitely toads. They eat them all the time. Skinks? Yeah. No, uh, they're about lizards. Man. Little lizards. Huh. Ooh, snakes. It makes me all queasy. Mm. Except a lot bigger snakes. Thanks for watching. And be sure to enjoy the Magi Cicada while they're here. Because they're not going to be here for another 13 years. Uh, hey, stop that! What are you doing? Uh, well, I was being a predator. You know, you said many types of things, ate them and stuff. Uh, not, no. If you would like to know more about the Magi Cicada, or any cicada, please go to these websites. They're where I got my information and pictures from. Ooh, ooh, and if you want to see more of me, in my underwear, and me not in my underwear, um, then M1, I don't know if he's wearing his underwear or not, but if you want to see more of us, click, click somewhere around here, it's like, is that where I'm supposed to click? M1, is that where I'm supposed to click? How should I know? Click on there and check me out. Well, you I mean, don't, these people. don't check me out like that, I mean, oh, you get the point. Bye.